Hey everyone, how's it going? So what am I working on now? Actually, I'm not working on this. Pablo's working on this. This came in yesterday. I was actually out sick yesterday. I was sick over the weekend. Well, sick for Sunday, Monday. Um, I've had this head cold and cough and stuff like that. It just kept on going and going and going. But I'm feeling better today, finally. Um, so anyway, Pablo got this in. It came in with a ticking noise. And he looked at it and he said, well, we got an exhaust leak on one side. But I definitely hear what sounds like a lifter tick. So I'm like, okay. So they decided to change the oil because the uh, oil was way overdue for a change. So they changed the oil and it actually started getting worse for some reason. Don't know why, but th this is what I've been told. It started to get worse. Okay. Now, did it start getting worse right away? I don't know. I don't know the full story on that, but it doesn't matter. It just, it happened. So they decided, let's take it apart and let's look, look at the lifters. Now, to get to the lifters on these things, you got to pull the heads off. So Pablo did that. He pulled the heads off, at least the one head, and that's where the lifters are located on these. Now, when he started to pull the lifters out, here's one of them, you know, and that looks perfectly normal. He did pull the insides out, and there's a reason for that. Now, the lifter roller, everything looks perfectly normal. Everything's fine there. But the reason he took the insides out was because, see the two there for, uh, it's the third and fourth one in? The third one was actually stuck, it wouldn't come up. So you tried grabbing it, would, you know, grabbing the edge of it with vice grips, couldn't get it to come up. Okay. So what he did was, he disassembled one because he wanted to see what it was like to pull apart. So he got it apart, so this way he could get a little slide hammer in there to grab it. He did that, and he was able to pop the, neck, the number three, well, it's not the number three, but the third one back lifter. He pulled it out, and this is what he found. See that? It's supposed to look like this. So as you can see, that's not good. Yeah. Now, think about it. The rollers, there's roller bearings that are supposed to be sitting inside here where the roller part of the lifter is there's roller ba there's needle bearings sitting in there so all of those disappeared and obviously this lifter had ground into the camshaft so now all that metal's up inside the motor he said he didn't really notice it when he changed the oil didn't really notice much of anything but if you look you can see all the galling and pitting right there on that roller itself now i wonder turn the light on if you could see down inside there Yeah, you see the cam is all eaten up and actually the lifter bore itself too see that that's all munged up so this thing needs a motor so yeah just thought i'd show you that i've actually i've had a few videos as you know with uh, ticking sierras and silverados and not one of them has been a lifter this one's actually a lifter unfortunately i couldn't you know make the sound or show you the sound on this one because i wasn't here for it so, but yeah, so this one's gonna get a motor. Hopefully when it comes, hopefully when we go do the motor on this thing, we'll pull the cam out and I can show you the camshaft too. That'd be another video. So, all right, you know, hopefully you're getting something out of my videos. If you are, hit that like button. If you could, please subscribe. All right guys, have a great day. Keep punching.